My name is Marco Rimanelli. I come from Tampa, Florida, uh, although I'm a native of Rome, Italy. And uh, I am here as the only Fulbright Schumann Chair on U.S.-EU-NATO relations at the College of Europe in Bruges. I applied to the Fulbright Schumann Chair because I never applied to Fulbright before. I am currently a full professor in international security and this was the most interesting opportunity through Fulbright to go back to Belgium, be close to NATO and the EU where I can do research and uh, do it at a level that will allow me to spend a year here doing my sabbatical. The important thing is that we're talking about relations between professors in an academic environment. So there are people who already have a track record in their own field. And I provided the, the, the liaison they needed to America. I provided the liaison they needed to bring students to NATO on uh, study trips that they have not had the chance. I also provided the opportunity of developing a conference on NATO, which I've done 10 days ago, um, with a very limited budget. Uh, and so that fit their niche where they needed to enhance transatlantic relations without having a lot of resources for that, but banking on the personal context, the scholarly context that the Fulbright Schumann professor brings every year with his own background and I was able through my previous years in Europe to make these networks and make it happen. I would give as an advice to any American scholar willing to come to Europe for a few months or an entire year on transatlantic relations and on EU relations, the advice that this is a very important soft power diplomatic tool that governments normally disregard but are very important at the person-to-person, education-to-education, institution-to-institution relationship. And therefore, there where we talk about relations between countries, we need to have people understand that it is very valuable to continue and invest money in educational exchange at all levels, from the Fulbright share down to the student uh, exchange program because that builds the bonds of transatlantic unity between North America and Europe and builds a sense of a common good, common destiny, common values.